Welcome again to Christ Giving 2012. There are bike riders that will train for months, sometimes years, to compete in a bike race. I have spent many weeks uh, practicing my gobble gobble. This is not one of those races. Gobble, 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 gobble. The training is waking up in the morning, make sure you get a little coffee in, and take care of the one hour that we just earned so we don't miss anything. Hundreds of riders hit the streets today. And you'll end up back here where you can drop off your food. To pick up groceries to fill local food pantries. I can fit at least uh, a bag and a half of groceries in here. Okay, gobble, gobble. What these riders lack in professionalism, <laughs> they make up with a tremendous giving spirit. Today is just a fun ride. It's, a, it's time for my wife and I to spend some time together and no kids with us and raise some, uh, do some good for a charity. And people are just having a good time and it's food for a really good cause. For food outreach, the Cranks Giving Ride is the biggest one-day canned food collecting event for the year. Our clients are living with HIV, AIDS, or cancer. We have over 2,000 clients on, on uh, pace to provide half a million meals by the end of this year. So any donation of canned goods, dollars, time, really makes quite a difference. For many, Cranksgiving is the kickoff for the holiday season. Happy Cranksgiving! And it's an early start to burning off all those seasonal calories. You're exercising, you're taking care of yourself. In Maplewood. Happy Cranksgiving! Wade Smith, Fox 2 News.